What is going on, guys? FIFA 18 EA have finally released some information about FIFA 18 career mode, which is absolutely exciting. We've all seen some footage uh, from the beta because people upload it on YouTube. Uh, normally, those accounts would get banned, but yeah. I think a lot of us have seen uh, because of search for it. I have myself, but I try to stay away from it because I want to be a bit surprised when I play the game myself. Uh, but here we are looking at the uh, new features. We have a little bit of a video at the end. I do have a link to Chesnoy Gaming. That's the video. Uh, he was able to play the game at Gamescom. So make sure you check out his video uh, if you want to see someone who's had some firsthand uh, experience of playing the official game FIFA 18 at Gamescom and career mode. And he gives his opinions really well of how uh, FIFA 18 career mode plays. So make sure you check out that video. Uh, but you can see here FIFA 18 career mode powered by Frostbite. Really excited for this next year in Frostbite, uh, like another year on the engine. Definitely uh, EA have a lot to work, but definitely gameplay uh, side of things. But we'll see about uh, everything else in career mode at least interactive transfer negotiations again it's something uh, you would have seen if you haven't maybe i'll show a little bit of a clip but yeah you can see from that that it's going to be definitely more interactive a lot of people uh, have expressed their opinions they don't really like that like just adding some cutscenes and that but i like it it adds a lot more. I said it myself. If they could incorporate something like they did with the journey, if they have that in the journey, why can't they do it in career mode? Definitely. So it says the transfer negotiation process has been completely overhauled. And that's what we want, overhaul. And they did that. So you can't really, to me, you can't say anything bad about that. I'm happy they added, they overhauled it. Really, they did. So <laughs> at least they overhauled some, some part of career mode, not the whole mode, because you know the menus look a bit similar. But anyway, it says the new transfer hub in the career mode main menu lets you keep track of all your transfer targets and listed players and utilize the interactive transfer negotiation system. I'm not going to read through all of this, just going to summarize. And again, I'll leave a link to this in the description if you want to read it a bit more, because uh, I haven't read this <laughs> all myself. I'm going to, I'll take a read myself uh, but you can see here you can meet in person in your office with the manager it says a lot there that's very good but apparently uh, there's no talking it just uh, has at the bottom um, it just the words what they say essentially so yeah there's no because it would have been hard for them to get all these different you got to understand people say oh that's crap the managers are not talking it's just you just have to read but Think about how hard it would be for them, for all the managers in the game, whoever, they don't have every single manager in a cutscene like this, but you get what I mean. A lot of Premier League ones, and I've noticed a few other a few other managers. Well, it's hard to get them all to do, like, <laughs> to do a commentary for it, you know, say their lines. It's, it's, it's very hard. Please keep that in mind for EA. I'm not defending them. Um, like, I'm not paid to defend them or something like that. But you, it's like some people don't understand how hard that actually would be. But you could think maybe get voice actors who could sound like them. I don't know. Maybe you could think about that. Uh, but you can see they have the meeting in the room there. And you can, there's a lot of things. This is what people, uh, people wanted to be added. You can offer more things like release clauses, bonuses for appearances, goals, and clean sheet bonuses. That is very, very nice by EA uh, to add that. And it just adds a bit more immersion to the game. So dynamic news clips powered by Frostbite. Look for Lukaku signing uh, with Jose uh, Mourinho. That looks really good. That looks really, really good. So that that improves. It, this improves the game mode uh, without a doubt. I don't completely agree. The people say, "Oh, it's just cutscenes. It doesn't change the game." But what else do you want? You know, this is a, this is a big part of football. And then yeah, you get to like signings for career mode. No doubt, that's one of the biggest part of being a manager. So this is a really big thing, and people are kind of not some some people like it, some people don't, but. I just think like <laughs> this is one of the major parts and they do have it in. So you got to give EA credit for that. Uh, you can see, for example, when players move clubs, you'll see uh, new dynamic representations of their announcement unveiling, including billboards, lineups. So see, it's really in-depth. Look at this. Uh, you can see there De Gea 
winning uh, the award as a player of the month. Uh, but yeah, uh, he's, he's a very good goalkeeper, that is for sure. Training with 15 or oh, more than 15, 15 plus new skill games in FIFA 18. There's more variety uh, when you come to squad training and you can have preset drills and you can sign them to certain players. That is that is something I wanted and I saw that. Like I saw uh, there's a Twitter account uh, where they just upload pictures of FIFA 18 that obviously had the beta. And yeah, you could sort different players uh, for different training sessions and you so you can repeat that at a later date so you can click it you make it like a preset so yeah very good the quick subs that's not really career mode you've seen that already team so if you haven't you can yeah, check those out uh, i'll leave the link in the description of this and you can see yeah, everything in this uh, but yeah these this seems like more of the gameplay stuff now so not career mode specifically uh but yeah as i said uh yeah, chesnoid gaming he's got uh, he's got his video up if you want to see someone talk about their opinions uh, from someone who's actually played the game. Like, as I've said, a lot of us, it's been available. Maybe not all of you guys have seen the beta, like, videos people have uploaded and everything like that. But this is, in those videos, it's not really someone firsthand playing the main game at Gamescom. So, yeah, it gets a bit more of a look into it. Just show you, yeah, different parts there so you can check out in the video um, if it interests you. But, yeah, you can see the tra- – you can see – just pause there for a second as well. Uh, if we just take a look, a bigger look at that, you can see uh, Virgil van Dijk as well there. Uh Uh, going for the signing of him. See, where it says, I'll show you here, approach to buy and delegate to buy. Delegate, I believe that is where you you don't have to go through that process, uh, talking with the managers. Because again, that would be a thing people would say, uh, no doubt, that it would get repetitive. But I, I think it'll be a bit different each time. It won't be the exact same conversations. They'll play out differently. So please keep that in mind. It won't, I don't think it will get um, as boring like that like it won't be the same lines every single time you know what i mean that's something i would uh i would do see so you can see some other options there End negotiation offer you can offer another player in the deal offer a transfer fee so there's different yeah ways it could be ending and then to say okay we have a deal so you can see just uh how the negotiations play out and i like that screen how it looks there it shows van dyke uh, the like the that's really it looks really really realistic real you got matip there <laughs> You guys say that's that's quality. It, it looks great. It looks great. I'm really excited. I just want to see if there's anything else of note. See, that's what people would say. The menus look a bit sa- like similar. Like it's not a huge overhaul. You wouldn't find many games that they like a game mode would have a major overhaul how it looks in the menus. They would keep it the same for a few years. Not exactly the same, but change the colors. They add a few little things like transfer hub. That's exactly what EA have done. So I think you got to give them some credits uh, where credit is due. And yeah, that is something realistic. And uh, let's just ch- take a look. This is more the, the gameplay uh, kind of stuff, but yeah, the La Liga uh, looks very good. So anything else in terms of that? Yeah, just ends with some gameplay. So in terms of, uh, yeah, in terms of the menus uh, in career mode, that's uh, that's where the features in career mode lie. Everything else, when you're in the games, it's really, it's, <laughs> it's, it's gameplay. It's the gameplay. So yeah, I'll leave that link in the description. Make sure you check out his video 100%. He got to play it. Uh, massive credit to him. And yeah, great opportunity. I'd love an opportunity like that one day as well. Uh, probably moving to England would be, help- <laughs> would be helpful for that. But anyway, guys, if you would subscribe to my channel, I'll be uploading FIFA 18 career mode stuff as soon as it is available on the on the early release, which I believe is the 21st. So just later this month, just uh, three weeks or so. It's, it's not too long, just over three weeks right now. And yeah, I'm really excited. I'm really excited to uh, get playing and get making some career mode videos. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, uh, turn the, the bell on the notification. So you get, so especially for when I, when I make my first video, you get notified on your phone, whatever, wherever you watch. Uh, yeah, come see uh, my first career mode as I did have a career mode with Manchester United in FIFA 17 with over 100 episodes. So expect a career mode like that again. A uh, very long series. That's what I like to do. So yeah, make sure you check that out uh, when I do uploads. And I'll see you guys in the very next video.